Welcome back, one and all, to Red Dead Redemption 2. Last time, we burned the Grace Tobacco Fields. Okay, girl. Now I've got a big old Shire horse because of it. So, you know, everything kind of worked out. Blucher deserves a nice bit of a break. There we go. That's the hat I like to see. Yeah. Oh, I'm in town. We never got a new gunsmith. kid reaching his hands out through the bars. New gunsmith definitely seems to be the case. I'll be running this shop long after you're gone. Just try to make friends, not enemies. All right, what do you want? Depends on what you got. Sure, don't go greasing up the pages, though. Wouldn't mind having that. A Litchfield repeater? That seems very nice. A majestic lever action breech loading rifle. Only a single shot. Listen, you won't take all day, will you? I'm shopping, buddy. I'd love to have the repeating shotgun. You're gonna buy something, right? I'm buying right now, you asshole. Shining. Glad you take care of what's yours. Looks like you're taking care of that weapon. Good to see. I'm giving it a that quick gun cleaning. Seems to be well taken care of. I can improve the accuracy of that, you know. That'll help, I'm sure.
That could really shine with some carbon in it. Ooh. Listen, you won't take all day, will you? Buddy, I am shopping. Actually, I kind of liked the dark wood. your weapon surprised if it still fires I put do some shots on that if you're interested I do clean my weapons thank you you'll notice the difference that could help that's a wise investment that's just pure aesthetic wrap is also aesthetic but it looks the nice now interested in engraving some make that weapon your own It's not on the barrel, that's why it's not showing up. You're gonna buy something, right? Yes, buddy. That won't mean much of anything if I... I'm just gonna have to wrap on it anyway. Listen, you won't take all day, will you? Why are you rude? Well, if that gun ain't shining, glad you take care of what's yours. That gun seems to be well taken care of. Weapon's only as good as its stock. Got some fine ones cut just for it. Well, if that gun ain't shining, glad you take care of what's yours. That gun seems to be well taken care of. Looks like you're taking care of that weapon. Good to see. Interested in a stock? Could put some carvings on it, too. Rifling isn't ultimately necessary on a shotgun. I mean, it can help, but it's not necessary. Most shotguns don't have rifling. Does this even affect your performance? You're gonna no. buy something, right? Yes, buddy. Don't be a dick. That could really shine with some carbon in it.
Interested in engraving some? Make that weapon your own. Ah, uh, yes. Listen, you won't take all day, will you? Why are you rude? You spent some good money there, and you're being fucking rude. You okay there, mister? You need me to move. Move? I am. I sit in the wrong place. Excuse me? No, I didn't mean any offense, sir. Please. I don't get your meaning. I'm very sorry, sir. You have yourself a fine day, and I apologize for any offense I may have inadvertently caused. What are you drinking, mister? Nothing, sir. Nothing at all. Why are you acting so strange? I don't mean to. I'm sorry for any offense. How could you have offended me? I have no idea. But I had no idea how I offended the last fellas. And they stole my wagon on account of my impudence. Stole your wagon for back check? Mm, they didn't like my medical practice, I suppose. I was helping folk. And that wasn't popular? I was undercutting the competition. Or I was too colored. Or I was irritating in nature. Or I was some know-it-all big city slicker here to demean some good old boys of Possible my fine Possible combination words. of the exact second and last variety of my sins was the source of some conjecture, so they undercut me. That ain't very nice. That was my impression. Still, compared to the gutting, castration, defenestration, and crucifixion they offered me, I felt I got off lightly. <laughs> Imaginative bunch. Yes. But no great love of my medical practice. Too free with my wisdom and services. Which way they go? Down the road, that away. Stay here. I'm sort of forced to. <laughs> Please don't go to any trouble on my account. Mm-hmm. Are you looking for that fellow's wagon? I heard him say they was taking it to Macomb's in. Okay, thanks. Macomb's end. Let's do it. Come on, Shire. Let's help out the good old, the good little folk. Homes in, they said. Probably just some clan bakers that need a good old pack and heat of the burning might of justice. That's
Watch it, buddy. Go cower under your bed. Lord have mercy. Shit. Yeah. Dick. Maybe I get to shoot some clan bakers. That'd be fun. Yeah. Easy now. Okay, I just got... Let's try that again. Try that again. So he tells her I'm not going to have access to my rifles. Oh, I do. This calls for the shotgun. Where you got the way, huh? In your grave already. Ah! Ah! Shotgun! I'll pick my horse up on the way back. Okay, come on. Get you back to the dock. Yep. Excuse me! I couldn't even see to aim! It's not fair! The frickin' wagon was blocking everything!
Nope. Why did I lose karma for killing assholes who were shooting at me? Is this doctor a snake oil salesman? That's very possible. He could very well just be a, a, a he could be a con artist. I mean, we ran into one of those up in Valentine. I dragged his ass in for a reward. Yeah. seeing that wagon again. No, you for that matter. Only people you won't be seeing are the folks that took it. Uh, I take it they aren't the only ignorant bullying clodhoppers in these parts. But I can live in glorious hope. Yeah, it wasn't a trouble now, was it? No, it was a pleasure. Yeah, it was a bit of trouble. Let me give you something for your pleasure. Ah, what we got here. Ah, how about this? Provide a man a tincture? He'll be well for a day. Teach him to make one, he might be well a while longer. I'll make sure to try and make this. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. It won't work for anything chronic, but you may not need it to. Well, if you see me on my travels and you're in need of something, make sure you come and say hello. Travel safe now. Special health care. Ginseng, yarrow, English mace, or milkweed. Huh. Neat. Come, Shire. Oh, there's a random encounter over here. Oh, another vet. I, I show my leg. Hey, mister. Can you give me some money? Here. Sure. Oh, thank you. Say, 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 where you from? Around. <laughs> Ain't from right here. Yeah, it was you I'd leave. This town lost its goddamn soul a long time ago. <laughs> Nothing but nasty, miserable people. Yeah? Yeah, ever since them, them greys moved here. They a bunch of no-good white trash. Yeah, they, they somehow got rich about 50 years ago. They moved here, caused a whole heap of trouble. Yeah, they reckon they was, reckon they was Yankee spies during the war and everything. That's so. Yeah, sure. Yeah, the greys aren't exactly very good people, but now there are the Braithwaite's. I suppose I've avoided talking about this long enough. The Civil War was not a good time for anyone. 
South fought for sovereignty, North fought for unity. It just sort of was what it was. I'm going to end this one here. Thank you all for watching. Join me next time on Red Dead Redemption 2 as I go talk to John Marston and see what kind of trouble he has for me. But until then, I am the Dark Seraph, signing.